So this is how you can lock your messages on Android. Let's get started. So at first, it depends on what exactly you use for messaging. So there are naturally more apps you can pick from. And if you use something like WhatsApp, then there is like a very cool built in feature for a chat lock. So you can tap on any of your contacts right there and just enable the chat lock and you'll be able to use your fingerprint, face or a password to unlock specific chats. So not only you lock the entire application, but only specific chats. So that is useful, of course. But a lot of people use the messages app, the built-in one for text messages over the carrier, like cellular messages, right? In that case, it doesn't really work the same way because, for example, you might want to get a app lock application from the App Store, right, from the Google Play. So if you get something like this, which, as you can see, appears to be safe and has a lot of, like, good reviews, using such app, you can download, uh, you can download this and just lock individual applications on your phone, even, like, the built-in apps, right? So it doesn't apply to just third-party applications, but using this you can set it up and just use the apps after, you know, getting through this particular application, which is supposed to lock them. So that is the ability too. But on the other hand, some phones also have the built-in feature as well. So inside of the uh, screen or if inside of the settings, you can find the security and privacy section. And in there you can find secure folder in a lot of cases, which then allows you to just store some sensitive data on a separate place. So you might want to look into that as well. So that's it. That's everything I wanted to show you. Hit the thumbs up if you found this video helpful. Subscribe for more. And I'm going to catch you in the next video in the future.